It's easy to spot ramps to nowhere along the nearly five mile long Earhart Expressway. The East West Highway was originally supposed to connect with major north south routes in Jefferson Parish, such as Causeway Boulevard. After years of delays, JP President Mike Yenny says the parish the could break ground right on a new interchange right at Earhart and Causeway here. this time and next year. We hope that after the right of way acquisition that has to take place over the next year, we'll be able to have some ground broken and some enhancements done to the first phase of this project. Drivers complain about traffic congestion in and around the Jefferson Highway corridor. Auctioner Medical Center has expanded in recent years, adding thousands of new jobs here. Folks we spoke with say new on and off ramps along Earhart are long overdue. I guess it's a good thing. You know, more exits, more people can get off sooner, less congestion. I travel up and down Earhart at least eight times a day. The more access I can get the causeway, the better. In addition to the new causeway interchange, parish officials are also planning future Earhart ramps at Dakin Street. That would connect drivers with Jefferson Highway near the Orleans Parish line. Another interchange at Leeds Street in Elmwood would reduce truck congestion on nearby Clearview Parkway and Dickery Avenue. There is also talk about a U-turn on Earhart located just east of Deck Bar Avenue. JP Councilman Paul Johnston says the causeway exit could take longer to complete than the other projects. The state's got to fund it. There's 120 million. We're putting up 7 million. And the state will have to find the funding to do the rest. And Jefferson Parish is also expected to soon begin a major widening project along Causeway Boulevard from Airline Highway to I-10. We're live at the Orleans Jefferson Parish line, Paul Murphy, Eyewitness News. Paul, thank you.